Hello there everybody and welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're all doing well tonight. Today I'm going to be showing you guys what I keep in my purse. Or my, I guess technically it's a backpack. It's these little chains on there. Um, I, have, I actually switch my purse out a lot. Um, just because sometimes I need more things, like a bigger, a bigger bag, a bigger purse. Sometimes I don't want to carry all that stuff around and I just want to have something a little smaller. So, um, this is my brand new purse. I actually found it, well, brand new backpack. I found it for a dollar. So, um, I'm gonna lower the brightness down just a little bit for you guys. There we go. So yeah, it feels like a very soft, pleathery feel. It's kind of squishy. It's kind of, like, puffy. Reminds me of, it reminds me of, um, like, early 2000s, kind of. And it's the perfect size for the things that I need right now to fit in my purse. But yeah, I really love the backpack styled bags. Um, the last month or so I've been using a purse about half this size, about this, it's a pretty short purse. It was the same width, but it was blue and it had little owls on it. It was just too small. All I could really fit in there were um, my wallet and keys. <sighs> Maybe like a chapstick, but that was really honestly all I could fit. So yeah. So have nice, cute little straps. Pretty cute. I'll put it on real quick. It hangs down pretty low. If I let it go all the way down, it kind of hangs to my lower back. Um, but I can adjust it and make it hang shorter, I guess. So. It's really cute. The little button here is like a little heart. A little golden metal heart. Which I thought that was cute. And it has a little metal button. Like a little magnetic clip. So the only thing I don't love about this purse is that it doesn't zip. Okay, I love a purse that zips because I am clumsy and I spill my things a lot. So, uh, you know, if this ever tips over, I'm gonna have lip glosses rolling everywhere and my dimes and nickels just rolling everywhere, so I gotta try to be careful with this purse. Or backpack. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna call it a purse, okay? Because that's what I'm using it for. There's one receipt in here. I try to be better about my receipts this year, just because last year uh, my receipts were a total mess. full to the brim, so there, there is still room. A little bit of room in there if I want to put a couple more things. The only thing that I do not have in here that I usually would would be a pair of like ear pods or ear headphones or like, you know. Um, but I forgot to put them in here because I just changed it out last night. And, uh, yeah. So, let's go ahead and get started. I'm just going to start grabbing things. First thing that I keep in my purse is this little Snow White um, zip up wallet. And I use this to keep a thing of check stuff, or not check steps, but checks, like blank checks, so that if I 
need to write a check for any reason, I have some on me. I don't write a lot of checks, but, you know, I like to have them in case, because you never know. And this was the perfect sized, um, thing. It was the perfect sized little wallet for my little checkbook. a nice little tapping sound. I like it. It's super smooth, too. My whole purse smells like um, cinnamon gum. <laughs> Dang it, that thing. Oh. My whole purse smells like cinnamon gum because that is the gum I have in here. And that's actually what I'll pull out next. Little trident. Cinnamon gum is probably my favorite type of gum. I like that and uh, like fruity gums. I think I actually might have another one in here that I haven't opened. I do. This one is Black Raspberry Twist. I can kind of smell it through the package. I've never tried this kind, so this will be new for me. But I've already. Already ate or chewed um, almost the half of this pack, and I just got these like like a, a few days ago. So. on sale at Target, I think, um, you get two, like, big packs that came with three different guns, um, for, like, I don't know, I think, like, four dollars. So, all together, I got six packs of gum for two bucks, four bucks. shaped. It was in a, um, it was in something like 
like this, but it was shaped like really cool looking. And she would always have it in this like little secret mirror that opened up and she'd have like her like special things, like her special perfume, special things that she would use before like work. She'd get ready for work and she'd have all this stuff. Well, I remember um, she would have that lip gloss in there all the time. So anytime I got the chance, I'd go into her little mirror and put some on when I was little. And I always wanted my own, so I got it. So I take that with me. Um, I have some fresh cherry carmex because I I am obsessed with like having some type of like chapstick or lip gloss all the time on. I just feel weird without it. So I at least have to have some type of chapstick. Um, this this is one of my favorite lipsticks that I have just because it tastes good. I know that sounds weird. And I don't wear lip gloss and lipstick to taste them, obviously. But it does taste good and it smells really good too. It's, it smells like chocolatey vanilla and it's brownish, which like a, I don't know, would you say that's like brownish? I would say. Let's see if there's an actual color on there. Alter Ego Hydrating Lip Stain. Comedine? Comedy? Com Comedian? I don't know, guys, I can't read. Okay, I can't read that good. <laughs> I'll be honest. <laughs> but it's um, Lorac, Los Angeles. And I don't know where I got this. I don't know where I got it, but I, I love it. I love it so much. So I keep that with me. Um, let's see. I keep a little lip liner, and it's also like a brownish color. I think it looks good with this lipstick here that I was just showing you. So keep those. And then this is my other lip gloss that I keep at all times. This one, um, Peace and Sorority had sent to me a couple Christmases ago, and it tastes really good, like fruity, and it lasts a long time, like it's a gloss, but it lasts a long time, and it's like a pinkish color, I'm not gonna put it on, because I didn't put this on, um, the only thing about this is, since it lasts a very long time, it feels very thick when I put it on, so I, I only wear it when, like, And I love it a lot, so I don't want to like use it all the time, but I do take it with me for like a good quick gloss look. So yeah, it's, it's Fenty Beauty, and the color is fussy. But yeah, this is my little lip gloss case, and it's my favorite because there's little ghosts and kittens and little bats and witches hats spooky things, the little witch on there, and the little zipper is a little ghost. See, and it has little heart eyes. I thought that was so cute. So yeah, I love this. I can't ever find this particular bag at thrift shops. Okay, so I only found this one time at a yard sale, but if I ever come across it again at a thrift shop or something, I'm gonna get more of these because they're the cute. this up just because my ID and everything is in there. All my personal cards are in here. But this is what I've been using for a long time now. Um, it says natural life on there and you might have seen this in my last purse show and tell. I'm not too sure if I had it back then or not. But I do love it. It has a little um, space right here if you want to put something that you use a lot right there or some like dollars or something so you have some cash. I love that little pocket. Um, 
and then the front of it has two owls and it says it's the little things dot 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 and i just think it's so cute and primitive looking it's so cute my mom actually got this for me i seen it at a yard sale but there was three dollars on it there was a three dollar price tag on this thing and i picked it up and i was looking at it and i was like oh that's so cute um and i was like looking for a wallet this size and everything and i wasn't about to spend three dollars on it for some reason i just i'm i, I don't know i like a i'd, I'd rather seem like a quarter on there <laughs> i don't know why i'm like that but my mom ended up getting it for me and i didn't know that she actually picked it up and got it so when we got to the car she gave it to me and i was like oh you didn't have to you didn't have to spend three bucks on it so i love it so much um since she did that i, I always think of her when i use this it's like she's the she's the mama owl and i'm the baby owl that's probably so nerdy but that's what i think about so that's me See, I have, of course, my mask in here that I wear when I go into shops and things, going to public places. Um, I really love this. this; is my favorite mask. I have quite a few now. Uh, I recently just bought one from Rue Twenty One silky Rugrats mask. I think it's so cute. And I haven't worn it yet because I'm waiting to see. Like, I'm, I'm just like, this one's my favorite just because it's comfortable. I think I've broken it in like with my ears and all. I don't know. Um, it's just cute to me. So, ooh, I'm excited about this next thing. I just got this days ago I had a Bath and Body Works free gift coupon thing um, so I went in there and I picked out this marshmallow pumpkin latte and it's a hand cream and I haven't I haven't smelt it I haven't used it I just I just got it mm. oh man it smells so good I'm gonna use some So usually I don't keep hand lotion in my purse, but since I since I have hand sanitizer in there and use it quite often now, um, which it's just this little strawberry hand sanitizer. Um, since I use that a lot, I don't want my hands getting dry, especially since the fall is coming up. So I am going to start carrying some hand lotion in my purse. almost got a candle there. It was like a um, marshmallow far fireside and I got that a couple years ago and I barely ever burn it just because I love the smell so much that I don't want the candle to go away or something. Um, but this candle, it was marshmallow fireside but it had something else with it. I can't remember if it was like pumpkin marshmallow or something. I don't know, maybe I'll go back and get it though because if it's anything anything like this oh man it smells so good it almost has like a salty caramel popcorn I wish you guys could smell it Let's see okay so this next thing I have I keep in my purse is this little change sack and that's all that's in here is just little a lot it's heavy it's really heavy um, and lots of change so when I go to yard sales um, obviously you can't pay with your credit cards or whatever at yard sales or your debit card or anything so this is what I use a lot of the times if I'm just going to some garage 
change sales or things like that. I'll just use this little change purse. And I love it. This is my favorite one. I know it looks rustic and old and has a butterfly. That's why I love it. Um, I found this, I think, at a yard sale for like 50 cents one time, and it's been my favorite for a long time. Like, it's just, it's not too small, and I like that it has the zipper. A lot of little change pouches that I will find have that little metal clasp thing, and I do not like those on I don't know why. They're very cute. They look very classy and old-fashioned, but I just, I don't know. I don't love them. I like a zipper. I'm pretty basic like that. Okay. Oh, ooh. So, these I keep with me. Um, my boyfriend's grandpa gave me these to start a project. It's kind of a long story, but I'll show you guys and I'll tell you guys about it just for a second. So, take this for instance. You see how the edge, the rim of it or whatever, is um, kind of poked out. I don't know how else to explain it. Like the middle piece is in indented. Well, he said that you can make rings, um, you can make little, you can make rings out of these if you tap them, I guess, for a, for a long time with the spoon. So he told me that if I ever get bored and wanted to do that, that I, I could make little rings out of these. So, it's really cool. So there's just some old coins I keep in my purse. See, I have a pair of sunglasses. These are pretty cute. They got a little flower, not flower, they got a little heart in the corner of them. And I know I'm gonna have, um, I'm gonna have the reflection on these, so I'm sorry. I won't wear them for a long time, but they are really cute. My friend sent these to me not too long ago, and I've been wearing them quite a bit. I usually forget to wear sunglasses when I'm out and about. I just, I don't know, I forget about them. But these, I've actually, like, I've been remembering to put them on just because they're extra cute. So. Let's see, I keep those. My keys. Not to, um, not do much of anything on there. The only keychain I have on here is Bob Ross, like a little, a Bob Ross thing. I have a lot more keychains, but I just, I don't use them because then it would get really heavy. <laughs> and, um, I've had a heavy keychain before and it ain't fun, so I try to keep it as simple as I can. And the last thing I have is a couple more lip glosses, which I could actually put in my little lip gloss case. So this is kind of like the other one I was telling you guys about, but this one is more of like a coffee color, like a mocha. It's called Mocha Latte. What do you know? I love it so much. And then recently I got this Ocean Mint Cocoa Balm moisturizing lip balm with aloe and coconut oil. It's called Sun Bum. It's really good. I use it a lot. That's probably why I keep it out just in my purse so that I don't have to go through this thing to find it. So, and that's everything that I have in there. And like I said, usually I would have some like earphones or something in there. Um, but yeah, I'm going to real quick before I say goodbye to you guys. But yeah, I keep 
trying to think if there's anything else I should put in my purse. I don't, I don't really know. I don't really know. I'm, I, I was carrying around a huge purse for a long time and it started giving me like shoulder cramps. So I stopped doing it that. Oh, I still got some things in my lap. I forgot. Sunglasses and my lotion. My sanitizer. Yeah. I don't know. I think it's cute. I think I'll keep this for the whole fall. Hopefully it'll last and everything. I can't believe I only found it for a dollar. I hope there was like, I hope it wasn't like, um, on sale because there was something wrong with it or something. I don't think. perfect for, I don't know, like fall and winter, I feel like, and it, you know, black goes with anything, so my last purse, as I was saying, it was kind of smaller than this, it was blue and brown, and it had like little owls and flowers, so I mean, it was super cute, but it didn't go with everything, like every outfit or every, you know, but I feel like this would be pretty which are switchy happy. I don't know. <sighs> Alright. But yeah, I guess that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope you guys rest easy tonight. And have a good night.